Hello, this is Eric from Support Adventure, and I just wanted to share some tips with you about how you can uh, work remotely on the telephone with voice over IP. Now, being a digital nomad, it's really important to have the best possible um, presence on the telephone. I think that, um, you know, it really helps your look as a digital nomad if there's a number that people can reach you at, at least for some part of the day. And um, I use voice over IP technology for support adventure um, to work uh, tech support. And um, the clients uh, can call me pretty much any time during the standard UK business business day, um, and that's made possible by Voice over IP, which works over the internet for those of you who don't know, and um, basically it gives you a local number, like in London it would be 0207, and then blah 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 blah, and uh, people can dial that number on a normal phone or a mobile phone and go through to your Voice over IP line, which can be configured on a on a variety of different devices so that people can reach you anytime. Now it's really important that, you know, you just um, think about this aspect of your business, especially if it's customer service, that people can call you, your clients can call you, and they can call you in a way that's easy for them, and that the quality when they do call you is excellent. So I'm going to tell you how to do that. Basically, first you need a voice over IP line. Uh, now, my, the company I use for this is called Hostcom. Uh, they're based in the UK. Their customer service is based in the UK. Not that uh, that matters if it's excellent, but um, they always pick up when I call um, during business hours. And basically, I really like their service because it um, is very easy. It's very standard with SIP, which is the voice over IP um, uh, protocol. But it's very um, easy to configure it on a number of different devices. Right now, I've got one of their lines configured on this Cisco IP phone. Cisco 303 IP phone, which is a three-line IP phone, so you can put three different lines on here. And I've got my headset, so it's just, this is the same sort of hardware that they have on desks in London or any city in the world where they do business. And basically you just, you know, you have speakerphone, you have speakerphone, you have uh, headset, and of course handset. And I much prefer this, I mean a lot of remote workers use soft phones, like Skype, but with the voice over IP. Um, yeah, like Skype, but um, basically um, I much prefer having a physical handset that's like a traditional phone. You know, it makes it really easy to hang up on people when they piss you off. Um, and the headset is good when you're sort of on the computer and typing and stuff. So basically, um, you just uh, plug this into your um, internet connection. Um, like a cable or DSL, plug it in directly with, with a cable. You can also get a wireless adapter for it. And uh, basically it works just like a normal phone. Now the second thing you can do is you can get one of these uh, Cisco uh, port adapters. Um, so what this does is it plugs into the internet, plugs directly into um, your cable or DSL modem, and then you can plug a normal phone into it, like a normal household cordless phone into here. And so basically it turns the internet phone line into a real phone line, just like the one you would have in the wall coming uh, old-fashioned style into your house. And this is useful. I don't use this as much as the other solutions um, because, I don't know, it's kind of limited. It doesn't have the features like call transfer and all this stuff that and the display um, that you have on the Cisco phone here. Um, and um, the other thing you can do is you can actually just set up a, a soft phone on your laptop and use the um, mic and speaker um, input outputs on your laptop um, to use a soft phone. That's my least favorite way to do this because, I don't know, it's just awkward fumbling with a headset, you know, every time you have to pick up a call and, you know, setting up a second sound card with speakers so that you can hear the ring while the headset's plugged in and you're off in the other room making coffee. I don't like the soft phone. Also, they crash a lot. Um, I prefer... This is my first choice. And my second choice would be, um, when I'm out and about, I use an app on my smartphone called Zoiper. So what I would do when I'm out and about, I would unplug this, and then I go on Zoiper here. Um, don't know if you can see it, probably not. Um, and I would activate my two phone lines here. And then it would connect. It can connect um, over mobile internet or Wi-Fi. Um, so basically, I, I just like having mobile internet. In Serbia here it works great. When in London it wasn't working great, but here it works absolutely well. And um, basically you have this app on your phone, and it's basically, it just 
works just like you are on the mobile network, on the local mobile network, except for it's a voice over IP line with uh, much better rates and whichever number from whichever country in the world you want to dial in based on which voice over IP plan you've subscribed to. And so basically, yeah, I mean, it just rings the same as a normal phone. It uses, it, it, you hook up a headset the same as a normal phone. Everything's the same except for it's running on an app which is going over your mobile internet to the server of your voice over IP provider. So that's basically it, folks. I mean, I, I, I think if you try voice over IP, um, you'll see the potential for going global with your business in terms of answering the telephone and being available at a local number people can dial you at. And that really is a big difference than being someone that people can just email, being someone that they find on Skype sometimes, that they, you know, are able to call you on Skype. No, it's pick up the phone anywhere, dial this number, and you get Eric. Most of the time, you know, when I'm not doing something that requires my intense focus. But yeah, I mean, the technology is here, folks, to make uh, your telephone presence seamless anywhere. So, I hope this video has helped you uh, learn how to use it. And uh, thanks a lot. Uh, subscribe to the Support Adventure uh, YouTube channel. We're an expat outsourcing company, giving people jobs, settling them in low-cost parts of the world, and um, hopefully making people's lives a lot better and more interesting by um, giving them work online and um, putting them in interesting, vibrant places around the world. So thanks for listening. My name is Eric. Support adventure, subscribe, and uh, we'll see you later.